hello everyone. We wanted to check in with our choir members to see how you're all doing and remind you to keep going with your music and your singing because as we all know music can bring us joy, it can cheer us up, it can bring us together with other people, with our family and friends. Um, so yeah it's good for the heart and good for the soul. Um, we wanted to make sure you're still smiling. We miss you all. Um, so I wanted to share with you some of the ways that I'm keeping my music going and, and um, enjoying music and one of the main ways is of course listening to music i listen to music when i'm cooking cleaning eating all the time um and you know to relax as well as we know music and singing can take place anywhere and everywhere so there's no reason why why we can't keep going with something we all love as quiet as our choir members um another thing you might want to think about doing is writing songs that's something i've sort of taken up recently um, and then composing music that's quite a difficult skill in, in music as we know and picking up the keyboard again and, and I, as a child I learned the piano so I've been trying to um, practice my piano as well so what have you been up to Mrs Berryman? Uh, similar stuff lots and lots of singing uh, getting my boys involved with stuff um, writing songs and putting on music around the house dancing to music singing while I'm washing the dishes just anything really just to lift my spirits and cheer me up because I find that singing is one of the best ways I have of cheering myself up. Yeah. And uh, with that in mind, uh, we wanted to share some resources with you today, just in case you haven't come across them yet. Things that you might enjoy doing at home. Uh, as my choir members know, I use the Sing Up website a lot and they've put on some resources that you can use at home. Um, if you go to www.singup, all one word, S-I-N-G-U-P, singup.org, forward slash sing up at home, all one word, then you'll come to all of their resources that they've put on for during lockdown. And for those of you that have really enjoyed doing the sign language song that we did this term in choir, if you scroll down on that page right near the bottom, you'll see that there's a link to British Sign Language and Makaton videos, and you can learn some songs with sign language. Um, there's lots of resources going on there. They add new things all the time, so that's a good one to look at. Um, and also with uh, signing songs as well, if you go to bbc.co.uk forward slash teach forward slash bring dash the dash noise. Um, if you go down on that page, you'll find a link to five songs in British Sign Language. And that's, that's got some really great songs there that you can have a look at as well. So, uh, oh, and uh, Young Voices. We yes. are... Uh, we're getting involved with uh, a project, aren't we, Mr. Ryan? We are on the second of June, which is not long, long away now, really, is it? No, no, it's uh, two weeks away. Yeah. So in two weeks' time, Young Voices are hoping to get to break the world record of having as many people singing "The Power in Me" as possible. And that's one of our favourite songs, as you all know. In assembly, I love that one. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Pepper Power, all of that. So, if you want to get involved in Young Voices. Uh, singing the power in me on the 2nd of June uh, there you need to go to their website uh, www.youngvoices.co.uk forward slash power in me and you can sign up there I've already uh, signed up Mrs Berryman have, yeah, um, yeah. I, believe, I believe Mr Gleeson might have signed up too and Mrs Crossland yes. and a few others uh, a few others yeah quite a few a few other teachers have signed up and if you sign up there they'll send you information about what it's all going to involve and so far they have shared um, a couple of videos, one explaining about the project and one teaching the first half of the song if you want to remind yourself of what the song involves and I think over the next couple of weeks they're going to be posting more information and I keep on getting things to my inbox yes about it yeah so hopefully we can get you all involved singing one of our favorite songs um yeah I think that's it isn't it yes yeah so thanks for taking the time to watch this video and uh, we hope we've um we've cheered you up a little bit and given you some ideas for the things you can be doing to keep your music going yeah. and we're wishing you all well and really looking forward to when we can all get together and sing again yes I'd, I'm, I'm really looking forward to that um yeah. coming together as a choir it'll be, it'll be great it so, will be fantastic yeah thank you everybody take care all right bye, See you later. bye. bye.